welcome back to the breakdown. Today, Minecraft 1.18 Caves and Cliffs came out. It actually came out about 20 minutes ago. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to download and play Caves and Cliffs. We're also going to be talking about the new Minecraft launcher. Just kind of mentioning that a little bit here because everyone's kind of being pushed to that Minecraft launcher. And I'm going to show you kind of where to go get that to start the process of getting it in this video. But first things first, we do have most of our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to start your very own Minecraft server in the quickest and easiest way possible. Apex takes care of everything from DDoS to actually hosting your server and the hardware and all of that. They also have 24 hours, seven day a week support if you do have issues that you can reach out to. We love it just Apex so much. We also have our own server. Play at our breakdowncraft.com on them. So again, you can check out Apex at the first link down below. The breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get your server up and running. Nevertheless though, we are going to go ahead and jump right on into this showing you exactly how to play Minecraft 1.18 and how to get it downloaded. Now, because I don't want to waste anyone's time here. The first thing I'm going to do is open up the Minecraft launcher and show you how to play Minecraft 1.18. Then at the end, I'm going to do a little minute or two segment on the new launcher and basically talk about how you can get that if you're having issues playing Minecraft. So obviously we need to open up the Minecraft launcher to do this. So here is the Minecraft launcher. Now, good news is whether you have the new launcher or the old launcher, it's going to be a similar process, except uh, on the new launcher, you'll log in kind of this way. And on the old launcher, you'll log in, well, via your Microsoft account or your Mojang account and all that stuff. That's kind of the only difference. Once you log in though, right away, you'll notice that if you have latest release selected here, for example, it'll say 1.18 on it. And that's the easiest way to download and play Minecraft 1.18 is to come here, click the little arrow next to the play button, select latest release 1.18, click play. When you click play, it will launch Minecraft up with 1.18 installed. However, if you do not have 1.18 here, or let's say, you know, 1.18 is not the most recent version anymore, thus it wouldn't be here. In that case, what you want to do is come here to the top and click on installations. Then you want to go ahead and click new installation right here and you can name this whatever you want. I'm of course going to name it play.breakdowncraft.com because that's our incredible Minecraft server. Survival Skyblock, you'll love it, can play on it. Anyway, once you've done that, you want to click this version drop down box and you want to select release 1.18. Now the reason you want to do that over latest release is because, well, in the future, if it's latest release, it will change when the latest release changes. So if you want to play 1.18 and you don't want to play any other versions, you want to make sure it says release. 1.18 there. I'm then going to change my resolution just so we can see better once we get in game and click the green create button in the bottom right. Now there's a few ways to play this. First you can hover over it here and click the green play button. You can also go back to the play tab at the top, click the arrow next to the play button and select it. There it is, play.breakdowncraft.com 1.18. When you click play, Minecraft 1.18 is going to open up with its awesome, huge, amazing biomes and all of that stuff. It's, it's, it's going to be pretty cool. I'm really excited for this update honestly. But yeah, we are now opening up Minecraft 1.18. You can see right up here in the top left, Minecraft 1.18. And then once we're on the main menu, it will even say Minecraft 1.18. Just confirming this is 1.18. I'm going to jump in game and all that just to show you. We are on 1.18. I don't want anybody saying that we're not because, uh, yeah, you can see back here. Look at the, look at the, I love these mountains and stuff. Absolutely crazy. We've also got Minecraft 1.18 in the bottom left. One thing I do need to do, though, you know, because we're just here. This is something I like to do. We're just going to go ahead and uh, change our settings live. So if we jump into single player, this is my 1.18 creative single player world that I have. And, um, yeah, once we're in game here, we'll be able to see that, sure enough, we are you know, had the extreme hills and all that stuff, and, um, yeah, I say extreme hills, but what I mean is, like, the, the, the crazy mountains and everything that 1.18 is known for. Uh, of course, I wouldn't spawn near any, but nevertheless, this is Minecraft 1.18. There we go. There's a mountain. Look at that. I love the, the, these new biomes and, like, new mountains and world height and everything like that. It just blows my mind. One thing that is the easiest way to see, though, is to go into game mode spectator, which we may already be in spectator. I don't know. We go into spectator and fly down, and we will be able to see that, uh, well, this kind of goes down forever, right? Like, it's kind of endless in some ways. I'm hoping we can see, like, a, uh, a lush a lush cave. I, I think that is my, my favorite biome now is lush caves. It's such a cool thing. Um, let's see. Of course, of course in this video I wouldn't find it, but I, I think we can go ahead and hit F2 here, or sorry, F3, and we'll be able to see that we are negative 55 coordinates, which, uh, definitely no negative coordinates in, uh, older versions of Minecraft, right? So, nothing, nothing to deny here that this is, in fact, 1.18. Uh, you are seeing some of the 1.18 performance issues. I have suspicions very quickly we are going to see a new release, or a, like, an updated release for 1.18, because it is so 
so laggy. I mean, I've, I've had some serious performance issues and I have a pretty good PC. So nevertheless, you are now playing Minecraft 1.18, but I do want to mention, look at that, see kind of a weird chunk issue there in 1.18. But anyway, we can go ahead and close out of this. I want to quickly mention the Minecraft new launcher. In the description down below, you have a link. You click that link, it's going to take you to the Microsoft store where you can see the new launcher. However, the best way to do that is just to click the little windows icon on the top or bottom of your screen, type in Microsoft store, and then open up the Microsoft store here, that app, right? That Microsoft store app that was uh, right there, just open up there we go. Open up that app right there. And then once you're in here, what you want to do is go ahead and search for Minecraft Launcher, right? Like so. And there it is, Minecraft Launcher Game. Click on that and here it is. Now, the 2.1 rating, that's legitimate. Uh, and that's one of the things people don't like this launcher, but they are pushing people to it big time. Once you're here, you can go ahead and install it. I, of course, have a play button. Uh, that's because I already have it installed, but that's how you can get the new Minecraft Launcher. It's not required by any means, and you can play 1.18 on the old launcher but my understanding is that eventually everyone will kind of be pushed and be expected to migrate to this new launcher. So I always like to uh, mention it in videos like this. So nevertheless, thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more incredible Minecraft 1.18 content every single day of the week. My name is Nick and I am out. Peace.